Hey guys, how's it going? Um, I wanted to do a quick little video about COPPA. Um, Zoe and I have been talking about it the last couple days, and um, we keep going back and forth on how important it is and how important it isn't, and blah, 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 blah. Um, <clears throat> The basic background is COPPA is the Child Online Protective um, or Privacy Protection Act. Um, and it was basically put into place, so I guess originally to keep children from talking to predators online or something, like in the 90s. But then... Um, in 2013, they're like, oh, but um, we're not collecting their actual information. We're just um, doing cookies on their computer so we could target ads to them better. Um, so a bunch of companies got hit with that. Uh, Mrs. Fields, TikTok, and finally Google. Um, and so Google lost a crap ton of money. And instead of based off of YouTube, I guess. And instead of um, going, okay, um, we're going to start trying to do better on that, they said um, it's on the creators now. My biggest issue with this is I'm not collecting anybody's data. When you subscribe on my channel, I don't get your email address. I don't get anything for that. When... Um, you subscribe to my channel, Google gets that information. Google puts information on your computer, such as cookies. Google knows how to market to you. I don't know how to do that. If I knew how to do that, I would probably have a lot more money right now, and I probably would be in a similar situation to Google. But this is BookTube. And we're just doing videos about books. And who, what little kid's going to want to watch me do anything? Like, none, right? So, I'm like, okay. So, I keep getting these things. And if you're on BookTube, you know this too. You get this thing that's like, you got to mark your videos for kids. Uh-oh, I just did a parrot voice. That could screw me, guys. So, I got to... Knock that off. Okay, you might think I'm overreacting. But wait, there's more. Okay? So, if you mark your videos um, for kids, that means that, and some of you might have already done it. I don't know <laughs> if you could go back and change it. But what that means is, is that your videos are meant for human beings under the age of 13, which means there will not be comments on your videos anymore. You will not have N cards. You will not have I cards. You will not have um, really any way to monetize your channel. There will still be ads, but your ad rates will drop to 10% um, of what they are now. So if you have over, if you are a monetized channel, that's the problem with mon that's what you'll find with a monetized channel. But if you're not a monetized channel, you will not be able to have comments on your videos. Your videos will not be searchable. Um, like they won't just like if someone types in Game of Thrones, like it won't pop up in a search. So right now I'm gonna look at this thing I got off of um Chad Ronick, Chad Tronic, I don't know. We've been watching these videos all morning and have been losing our crap. Um, so when you mark it, this video is pretty good if you want to go watch it. Um, marking not for kids doesn't protect you. Um, we've just watched, well, I've watched more videos than me and Zoe have, but me and Zoe have watched a couple this morning on top of it. And I don't even know, remember what I found in which video anymore. So anyway, um, your video will not have notifications. Your video will have no comments. Your video will not be searchable. Your video will be will not be suggested or recommended, and the video will make 90% less revenue. Um, all of this also applies when you mark an older video, too. Okay, so if you 
put that on there thinking that, oh, I'll just mark for kids and then that way no one will come at me, okay? That's not how this goes. Now, actually, let me go to the next image that I got from that video too. So um, this is from the act itself or whatever, um, talking about subject matter and presentation. And this is where we freaked out a little bit. So subject matter that is appealing to children. Because what is subject matter that is appealing to children? Well, kids jokes and music. Kids music? No, music. So music um, is appealing to children. Games, kids games, video games, computer games, children's TV shows or stars, cartoon characters, sports. Now this is where we're going to get screwed here. Stories, toys, children's books, fantasy, children's arts and crafts, pets, Products primarily purchased or consumed by kids like snack food or cereal. Zoe eats more cereal than anyone I know. I haven't had cereal since <laughs> Donut One. <laughs> okay, I guess also, I guess all brand doesn't count as a cereal say, for kids. All brand, a, <laughs> all brand is a pensioner drink. Yeah, um, okay. Cereal if anything. All right. So this freaks me out because we were actually. Um, Jason at Old Blues Chapter and Verse, we were going to do this thing this Halloween where we read stories, like scary stories for Halloween. We were going to do like um, Edgar Allan Poe and um, Algernon Blackwood and M.R. James and stuff like that. That is subject matter for kids now, so we can't do that. Um, children's books. I have gone over children's books before because there's some cool children's books I like. Um, one of the things that really freaks me out is comic books. Um, I already went through my channel and took off. Um, one of my videos had an actual image of a certain web slinging person. Did you just say certain? No, I said certain web slinging person. Mm. Um, so I had to take that down. Okay, now, you might be thinking, why are you going through all this? Just, if, if your stuff's not marked for kids, who cares? If you get fined, or if you get found out by FTC or by YouTube that um, you have any of these things, and you've already marked your video as not for kids, but they find this stuff anyway, you could face up to a $42,000 fine per video. Now, most of you are thinking, that's not going to happen. This is not YouTube doing this. This isn't Google doing this. This is the government doing it. And YouTube is just saying, that's cool. You could go after our creators, okay? This is making this whole platform crap, okay? This whole platform will suck now, okay? Because everyone's going to be minding their P's and Q's. Because in January 1st, when this happens, a bunch of YouTube channels are going to vanish, okay? Now, the only, and like big channels, like I know some of you might watch them, some of you might not, but like Markiplier, um, PewDiePie, I don't know if PewDiePie even has a channel anymore. But anyway, um, but also, I don't know where YA falls into this, like young adult um, or middle grade books. I know a ton of booktubers who do middle grade books. You're screwed. You need to either mark those videos as kids safe, um, which might screw you in other ways, or just like put the videos on private or something. Um, but if you mark those videos kids safe, the community we've built... We won't have any more because we will not have comments. We will not be able to talk to each other through comments. So the only way I see this working, not this working, but how this, how we move on from here is that some company in Russia is going to make like YouTube or something like that. A place where anyone from around the world can put up any video they want and monetize it and the government won't come after you. And then they're going to get everyone's information, and then they're going to use it to start an actual war where people blow stuff up and shoot each other. I'm not a drama queen. Watch. Mark my words.
I have spoken. <laughs> you speak very fast and very loud. Because I'm very freaked out right now. So let's go back into presentation here. So language of the website, such as language that is simple enough to be understandable to children 12 and under. So I guess Steve's channel's okay. Um, short, colorful descriptions, slang, and pop culture phrases like, ew, boomer. Am I right? You've just done it. Yep. Um, uh, kids' site may be identified by such languages. Kids only. Fun. Free stuff. Whatever. Cool. Duh. Games. Ask your parents. Etc. Um, whether the website uses visual content appealing to children. Now, this is where more things happen. Animated graphics. Animated characters. Bold or fast-moving graphics. Bright and vibrant colors. So... Um, with that being said, make sure you look like crap and you're dead. Um, don't have much color, just have a very pale pallor, okay? Um, so for any of you who like collect Funko Pops, for instance, Funko Pops of, um, books, characters that you like or whatever, Potter. Harry Potter, Oh, dude, all you Harry Potter fans, you guys are screwed. Screwed! Hey, be serious. I'm Harry. being serious. You're screwed. Like, you, if you monetize... Oh, man, dude, the, the cool kids, the booktube cool kids, you know who you are. You guys are fucked. Fucked. Completely fucked. Do you feel like you've explained to everybody exactly why? Which part? Like, why they're screwed. You're screwed because your community is gone. Because if you put that your videos are okay for kids, you will not have comments on your videos anymore. You will not be able to interact with your viewers. From the 1st of, June, um, 1st of January. I think right now, if you put that on now, oh, really? your comments are gone. Oh, shit. I almost knocked my computer off. Okay. But yeah, January 1st. Um... What else was, was I saying about it? Sorry, I derailed you. You totally... You, we were talking about Harry Potter. People who have Lego yeah. and stuff in the oh, background. Oh, Lego, and Funko Pops. And um, I can't remember if it was that last video we watched or if it was another video I watched yesterday. But basically, if you don't know if a video game or a book series or a television series based on a book series is geared towards children, this is where the FTC just comes in and bends us all over. If you have a Funko Pop of that character, that means that is a toy. That means that toy is sold in stores. That means kids can see that toy. That means kids can fall into that. So, um, Stranger Things, It, It, Pennywise the Clown, it's a freaking clown. Um, what else? Like, if there if there's a Ron Jeremy Funko Pop, you're screwed. No. No? Why? If it's a toy that is oh. sold at a store, that's a toy. Toys are I for know, kids. But Ron Jer nobody knows what Ron Jeremy is. Kids. That's not, like, aimed at kids. Are you gonna wrestle the FTC on that? Yeah. Oh, bull crap, dude. Um, let me see. What else? I have a Cthulhu Funko Pop here. I have a Ron Swanson Funko Pop here. I have a Dale Cooper Funko Pop here. We have all the Universal Frankenstein. Yeah, and all stuff. of those things we can't talk about. Or have them like in the thumbnail or anything that would. Yeah. Um. Any. I have tons of videos where I'm wearing shirts with Link from Legend of Zelda on it, or Computer um, games. video games. Yeah, I have I've streamed video games on here, so I have to take those off. Um, all the verses videos me and Zoe did, I use the verses from Mortal Kombat, and it's all vibrant and bright, and it's an animated um, image. I got to take that out. Can you not just change the image? Yeah, I'm gonna just take it out. I'm not going to take those gonna... videos down. Oh, yeah, that's what I'm asking. But then she's like, but the Benny Hill song's on there. Like, that's a that's a song. Is that, like, kids? 
who knows what is going on right now so basically um comic books i'm not going to do comic books anymore um and if i do i don't i you know what i'll do i'm not going to do comic books until let's say after the first of the year like into the spring i want to see if any comic book channels get popped cuz i think they're gonna Which sucks because I have so much to talk about. Um, Tom King is just destroying everything that ever happened in the history of forever. So is Brian Michael Bendis, and I can't talk about it. Um, 5G's coming up. Um, I got all excited about JT4 taking over the title I like. And um, then there's these big prices. I don't know if even Steve knows about this, that all the... If you want your old comic book characters, you're going to have to pay $7.99 a month for those guys in a comic book. So, um, I can, can't... I, I don't understand. Can you not talk about those things as long as your channel isn't, or your video isn't aimed? Let's look at it. Well, yeah, you can. But, it, but as long as if, it's... if YouTube or the F FTC find out that we say we're not for kids and we talk about those things and ads are playing and comments are on and all this other stuff's going on, that's how you get fined the $42,000. Uh, okay. So you either destroy your channel by saying it's for kids and you have no ads, no way for anyone to find it, you can't communicate with anyone in your community, so you might as well not be on... YouTube, maybe everything will go to Instagram and we'll have a good, like, golden year of Instagram before the FTC comes after Instagram. Um, I don't know what's going on, but it's not good. And this is not a conspiracy theory. This is the law. I thought it was like a big drama, and then I watched it, and I'm like, no, they're actually doing it. I can't even show Fred in a video anymore, because some kid might accidentally give their freaking information to Google. So, I don't know. So we, someone can't could... have, we can't have the dogs in the video. Are you paying attention to anything yes, that's am, happening? But, but what I'm saying right here. is, listen. It what? says, Cra arts and crafts. Pets. Yes, but listen, is it a video just about pets? I don't know. Or, you know, all the, this all is, the clips... Okay, this says like subject matter, and then it says presentation. So, subject matter that is appealing to children. So, technically, if you wanted to try to wrestle this, but what this... Okay, it says um, subject matter is appealing to children. So, if you don't have any of these words in the title, maybe that's okay. Yeah, because but if someone's a, looking at hours of, like, building crap in the desert, and then it just so happens to have Fred in the middle of the video, that's not aimed like at we children. Should, but you know what? I do put pictures of Mina or I Fred know. as the picture for the video, so I have to change those now yeah. to some stupid, boring picture of me looking hot. <laughs> um, but I'm talking more about BookTube right now. Okay. Okay, so... Um, yeah, I don't even know what to do about the Homestead channel because that is instructional or educational, even though we say we don't know what the hell we're doing. No, we don't know what the hell we're yeah, doing. Yeah, but that's still instructional or educational, which is crap. Yeah, but it's not an arts and crafts thing. That's what they, they were talking about. It's mainly arts and crafts videos. No, you know, no, no. Where people are making uh, the little No, because remember they were on that other channel, they were talking about the guy who, um cut snakes open with his son to see what's inside of it. It's an educational show. Yeah. But that, compared to what we're doing, is a very different kettle of fish. There's a kid on that. Yeah. It's like an educational, kid-friendly show. Like, ours is know. just us building stuff. Like, I know for a fact when I was a kid, I would have avoided our, our videos, like, the plague. Oh, that's because you were a nerd. So anyway, back to YouTube though, um, or back to BookTube. I don't know what's going to happen, but um, I guarantee some of the heavy hitters on BookTube are going to go bye-bye. They're not going to be on BookTube anymore. I guarantee it. Um, 
And then some of some people might go, yeah, but you know they could have paid sponsorships and blah 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 blah. Um, and they probably could. And Disney or whatever um, those books are, I can't. It's not. It's not Disney. It's like a subdivision of a subdivision of Random House's basement's butthole or something like that. Um, they get to like have a sponsored video um, showing some book or something like that. That won't work because now you are marketing to children. Even if you say your channel is for kids um, or not kids. If it's a Disney book, you're fucked anyway, probably. Oh, everything's awful right now. Any, any, I can't even talk about Star Wars for F's sake. No. Man, that's a train any wreck. Any middle grade school book, any middle grade books. Yeah. That's automatic. Do you think, do you think Twilight falls into that? I know we're like super Twilight's boomer. Twilight's YA. Yeah. So it's, what's the definition of YA? Because if it's anything below 13, yeah. then yeah. I don't know. I don't know what the definition of it is. No. So anyway, if you fall into any of these categories, you're screwed. And um, uh, Google has, or YouTube sent a thing out saying that you should just talk to your lawyer about it. Um, now, if you don't have... Uh, enough income coming in off of YouTube to justify you hiring a lawyer to figure this out, then I guess you're just screwed. Yeah? So, we're not taking anyone's information, YouTube is, and we're getting screwed for it. So, that is the FTC, that is Google, that is YouTube, and that is how I think it's going to affect BookTube. So um, until, I mean, I'll keep putting videos up here um, that are, I'm going to be gutting my videos right now um, on every channel that I've ever had. Um, so like, that's another thing too. If you're like, oh, I used to have this channel that I used to play with My Little Ponies or something on it. It was really fun way back when. My Little Shady's. Yeah. Stop talking about it. Don't give me any yeah. ideas. But um, you need to go back and obliterate that um, or do something because if you're still technically the owner of it, even though you haven't uploaded anything on it in years, um, either YouTube is going to just delete the channel or something. So um, I don't know. I, 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 I don't mean to be the bearer of bad news, and I hope you guys have a beautiful day. Um, but you need to worry now and figure out if this is even worth doing anymore. Um, boy, I'm sounding down, huh? Yeah. Okay, now I gotta go make another video like this on the Homestead channel. Whew. I don't think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna call it a day. Take care, everybody. Bye bye.